the government says it will double livestock and poultry registered uh, farmers across the country as part of efforts to uh, boost local production of meat and poultry products. This, uh, the Greek ministry revealed, is part of efforts to ban meat and poultry, poultry importation in the near future. The Rearing for Food and Jobs policy is a component of the Planting for Food and Jobs agenda, which saw significant production of rice in the last quarter of last year. The first phase of the program, which was piloted, saw the distribution of some animals to registered farmers. Deputy Agric Minister George Odro bemoaned the increased importation of meat products, explaining that all that would be a thing of the past if the rearing for food and jobs is rolled out in full scale. We registered some farmers across the country. In the northern sector, we were giving them sheep and goats. In the southern sector, poultry, cockery and then the piggery. So what we did, unfortunately, the number of people who registered exceeded what we budgeted for. So we were giving, in terms of goat, we give you nine female, one male. In terms of sheep, same. Piggy, same. So the number of people who registered, in fact, was overwhelming. So you have realized that the interest people are showing in the agri sector, you have to do more. Ghana currently has six breeding farms in operation, as opposed to 28 in 1993 and currently imports about $400 million worth of meat products annually, with local meat production accounting for only 19% of the country's meat requirements. This year, we are going to expand or double our budget for the railing for food and job aspect, thereby increasing the livestock uh, aspect of the planting for food and job. For that's increasing the protein sector. So as time goes on, by the, the next year or two, do you know that we import intestines? We import intestines from abroad. Yes, go to the coastals and check. So this is what we are, have to, we are trying to work towards, so that if we're able to stop the importation of rice, we're able to stop importation of meat and all these poultry products, our living conditions will change. 